All right, we have two questions. One, why don't viruses have a kingdom? And two, why don't some people consider them alive? Some scientists consider them alive. Well, uh, the first question, why don't they have a kingdom? Well, here's a diagram from your textbook of the six kingdoms. Although uh, they're called domains in some cases, but these can also be called kingdoms. Kingdom bacteria, kingdom archaea, which together make up Whitaker's kingdom what? Whitaker's kingdom monera, who came up with the uh, bacteria and archaea uh, setup? Weast, that's right. Weast divided monera into bacteria and archaea. There's also kingdom protista, the plant kingdom, the animal kingdom, and kingdom fungi. But viruses have no place within this kingdom system. Anybody's kingdom system, and why is that? Because these are the kingdoms of what? They are the kingdoms of life. And so why don't viruses get a kingdom? Because they're not considered to be alive. So that's the answer to question number one. Why don't viruses have a kingdom? It's because these are the kingdoms of life and viruses are not considered to be alive. But question number two, why are they not considered to be alive? Well, you know, that's just a matter of definition. Uh, you know, you have a definition of life. What is it? Well, we'll see in a second here, but either viruses meet that definition or they don't meet that definition. That's all there is to it. So what is the definition of life? Well, we came up with one quite a few weeks ago. We said, in order to have life, you have to have at least what? In order to have something called alive, you need to have at least what? At least one cell. One cell. Anything less than a cell, including the parts of a cell by this de definition, are not considered alive. A cell is alive, a living cell is alive. And you can have many cells, but you got to have at least a cell. And so, viruses, are they a cell, more than a cell, or less than a cell? Well, viruses, whatever they are, are less than a cell. Here's a diagram of a virus from your textbook. We're going to talk a little bit more about it. But whatever it is, even though it says it's got DNA, this is a whole lot less than a cell. And so... Why are viruses, why don't they have a kingdom? They're not considered alive. Why are they uh, not considered alive? Because they are a whole lot less than a cell. This would be an example of one type of virus. We'll talk a little more about it. But that is not a cell. It is a whole lot less than a cell. So there you have it.